Welcome back to another episode of Prodigy Breaking News. In today's video, I'm covering over some of the new updates which have dropped their way into Prodigy during the month of November. So without a further ado, let's get straight into our video. Alright guys, so I'm your host, Wen Dr. Genius, and let's get straight to it. So as you guys may notice, here's the thing. It's November, so you guys know what happens every month. Now, every month, Prodigy gives us a new membership box with exclusive items. So, as you guys may know, there's an exclamation sign above my mailbox. What does that mean? Well, it means... Hey guys, you may or may not know this, but I started a new gaming channel. My gaming channel is called One Doctor Genius Gaming. On this channel, basically, I'll be posting gaming videos on Roblox or other types of games using Minecraft or other stuff. And basically, I'm going to be posting some entertaining gaming videos, so if you guys want to see cool gaming videos by One Doctor Genius, well, check out the channel, links in the description, here's the homepage, and yeah. I have gotten myself my membership box, and now that I have a membership box, let's open our membership box and see what's inside, right? So here we go, it says your November membership box is here, right? Please enjoy this month's membership box containing awesome member items. Return as a member on the first of every month to receive the next month's membership box, right? So yeah, let's open our box and see what we get. Opening and kapow cabbage. The membership box has opened up. And now over here, it seems like we've gotten a neon outfit, a morph marble, some shivers, and a chicken. Chicken and along with a nessile? <laughs> Missile. <laughs> along with Nestle, yeah. We also got a Nestle. Let's go with that. I'm totally gonna pronounce that Nestle from the rest of this video. Never mind, it's pronounced Nessie. So right over here from that membership box we got a couple of things. So from that membership box, the first thing which we got is a neon outfit, which is pretty cool if you guys ask me. Over here it says, light up the room in this neon accented outfit, gifted from a membership box. So you know what, let's wear that. Now we're wearing a neon suit. Yeah, I'm shiny. You know, I remember going to a laser tag game once on my friend's birthday, and what I decided to do is I decided to wear a bright neon orange shirt, and under UV lights, that neon orange shirt was shining, and I somehow managed to get 4th place. It was like a team battle, and somehow I managed to get 4th place in the game. So that was pretty cool. I mean, that game with my friend, a laser tag, was pretty fun. I managed to get 4th place while shining out like a star, because I was wearing a neon orange shirt. Alright guys, so if you ever go to a laser tag place, do not wear a neon orange shirt or any neon color because you will stand out. And trust me, I was sparkling like the sun in that neon orange shirt in the laser tag game. But now over here we have a nestle. Though nestles prefer the water, it will happily swim in the air and follow you for treats, gifted from a membership box. Alright, so the nestle seems like some sort of seal in Prodigy, and as you guys can see, it seems like it's a swimming seal which will swim over the water. That's pretty cool. I mean, if you look over here, our tiny seal should follow us. And from this membership box, it's pretty cool. It seems like we've got a tiny sea otter following us. That's cool. Now, I am going to test this armor out pretty soon. But the first thing which we're going to do is we're going to check out the new arena season. Because you guys know, the first of every month means we get a new arena season. Yeah! New, a new arena season. A new season to murder people and have no charges. Right, so let's click on the arena caller and see what season it is. It's the Contest of Champions, November 2020. And it seems like it ends in 28 days. Well, it's 27 because I live like in a day advance, but still. Yeah, it ends in approximately 27 days. And over here, as you guys can see, the challenge has just started. If you go to, into our arena season, under 10 hours, people have done over 107 battles, right? Someone has managed to do 107 battles under 10 hours. Because the ch arena challenge only lasts for 28 days. That means it hasn't been 10 hours yet. And someone managed to do 107 battles in 10 hours. This is absurd. Like, how do people do this? It's, like, super hard to get in the top thousands now. Because of what Prodigy did. It's like, e, I need to get into the top thousands to get the prizes. Now, if you look at our prizes over here in the arena board, you guys will notice something. Right, for our prizes, the things which we can get are the Tech Wizard Runners, Tech Wizard Lens, Tech Wizard Suit, Tech Wizard Laser, and Drone. Right, so let's get started. So now you can get the Tech Wizard Runners at a thousand trophies. It says, High Tech Shoes of the Future. Of course they light up. Like, why wouldn't we have light up shoes? And this looks pretty cool. Now next up on our list we have Tech Wizard Lenses. Who needs glasses when you have one of these? Technology sure is amazing. It sure is. Right, so now you can get the Tech Wizard Glasses for 3,000 trophies, which is approximately... 30 battles, yeah, which is 30 battles, you can get this from doing 10 battles, 
you can get this from doing 80 battles and you can get this by doing 150 battles which is absurd but okay right so now another thing i noticed is that this armory type in prodigy it fits the neon suit as well right so if you guys get the neon suit and you guys manage to get the arena season prizes well you'll be looking cool because this neon suit and these headlights match each other match each other pretty well Right, so next up for 8,000 trophies or 80 battles, we have the Tech Wizard suit, a super cool suit built with the latest and greatest technology. I don't think it's going to be the latest and greatest technology for a while. I mean, it's going to stay that way for a couple of years, but it's going to eventually get outdated. And now another thing I forgot to mention is that all of these armor sets are going to be doing a heart bonus of 6, while the wand is going to be doing a damage bonus of 15, and it's always going to be a 3-person spell. Now, it seems to follow this type of trend in Arena Seasons that it always does 6 health bonus and the wand does how much damage? Yeah, the wand does 15 damage, but other than that, over here we have our grand prize. Now, our grand prize is a drone, right? So, so it says this drone has so much energy. Who knew they could make such fun buddies? Right, so it seems like it's some sort of doggo drone with propellers on top of its head. And, you know, it looks pretty cool. So, because of the items which I've seen in this arena season, I'm satisfied. I will be trying to make it into the top thousands of the arena season. And every week, I'll update you guys on where I am. Alright, guys, let's get straight to the battle by using this new armor which we got. Right, so first of all, let's figure out how much 60 health is. Right, so first of all, we need to figure out what our base wizard health is, so we'll remove all of the armor. Right, if you go to view, a level 100 wizard has 10,400 health. Right, that's pretty cool. Now let's put on our armor. So it seems like 6 heart bonus manages to add to us approximately 624 health. So does this mean 6 heart bonus is 624 hearts in prodigy? Well, yeah. So now I guess we know how much health bonus a suit does. So basically, this suit gives you an additional 624 hearts in Prodigy. So now we're going to be taking our additional 624 hearts in Prodigy and be doing a battle. Alright guys, so we have a good armor set on and as you guys can see, I have no boots or anything which will heal me. So now what we're going to do is we're basically going to do a battle with our base help in Firefly Forest and see how well the battle ends, right? So let's search up for an opponent. We're going on a trip to find a battle opponent. Let's go searching and murder some monsters. Right, alright, so over here, unfortunately, a trip drop has spawned. So that trip drop can say bye bye. Alright, let's go fight it, and here we go, battle loading. So now we're gonna test out how cool this armor looks in battle and what it does. So it seems like our wizard is backward, so let's just switch our items and push our wizard forward. Right, so if you look at the armor, it doesn't have a neon glow in Prodigy, which is kind of disappointing. I expected the armor to have some sort of glow, but apparently it doesn't, so that's disappointing. Well, other than that, let's see how the armor moves and whether they've designed everything in it. Right, so when we cast a spell, it seems like our wizard just lifts his hand up and casts it. Right, so if you ask me, that attack animation is pretty cool. Now, do I like the suit? Yes. Is the suit perfect? No. I mean, if Prodigy can add a neon glow and maybe give us, like, the rest of the suit, well, then that would make it amazing, because just, like, imagine walking around Prodigy with a neon glow around yourself. That would be pretty cool. Alright, guys, so let's cast our spell using our neon glow powers and doing another 4,000 damage to the monster and terminating it in an instant. Alright, guys, so it seems like Mr. Monster has been defeated, and if you ask me, this suit of armor is pretty cool, though it doesn't satisfy what it said. Honestly, I expected this suit to have a neon glow, but okay. I guess it must have taken a little bit too much time to animate. Alright, guys, that's all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found out about the new updates which have dropped their way into Prodigy. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell and give this video a humongous thumbs up. And I will be catching you all next time. One Doctor Genius out the house. Bye, have a good time.